In this video tutorial, we will learn some very uh, special formulas in algebra. Um, in algebra, these formulas are used very often and you have to uh, know and use these formulas because um, these formulas are very important. Let's get started. Like us and subscribe. So, um, uh, this special formula in algebra looks like uh, when we have uh, such a polynomial uh, x to the power m minus a to the power m, this polynomial is divisible by x minus a. And uh, the result of the division is division is some another polynomial of degree m minus 1. Because, first of all, we had a polynomial of degree m, and we divide our polynomial by another polynomial of the degree 1, and resulting polynomial will be uh, a polynomial of degree m minus 1. In particular, uh, the special case of this formula for m equal to 3 is very uh, famous formula when x to the power 3 x cubed minus a cubed is represented as x minus a um, times some another polynomial of degree 2. How to prove these formulas? Uh, first of all, we have to know um, Bezu uh, theorem we gave in our previous tutorial. That's why uh, to understand uh, our tutorial, you have to watch our previous tutorials. That's why very important to watch our uh, algebra playlist consequently, uh, tutorial after tutorial, and you will uh, have a very strong understanding of beginning of algebra. Let's uh, begin to prove our formula. First of all, uh, from previous tutorials, we know that assume a polynomial p of x, uh, which is equal to x to the power n minus a to the power n. Um, special case when n is equal to 2, first of all, let's assume that x is equal to 1. That's why um, x minus a is, can be represented as x minus a to the power multiplied by 1 uh, because x minus a is divisible by x minus a. When our n is equal to 2, we have x squared minus a squared. And from uh, shortcut, shortcut uh, special formulas we gave earlier, we know that uh, this can be represented as x minus a times x plus a. And that's why, because of uh, this representation, um, this polynomial x squared minus a squared is divisible by x minus a. And uh, the quotient or result of this division is equal to x plus a. That's why this representation is valid. Uh, we already know this from previous tutorials. But what if we have a higher degree, for example, x to the power 3 minus a to the power 3? In this case, um, we will show that um, our polynomial p, uh, let's denote this as pn of x, and let's call it p3 of x which is equal to x uh, to the power 3 minus a to the power 3. Let's show that this polynomial is divisible divisible by x minus a. And uh, to prove this, that our polynomial is divisible by x minus a, we can use two methods. The first method is manual manual division 
how to divide one polynomial by another polynomial, watch again our previous tutorials. Uh, the second is to use Bezu formula, or Bezu, not formula, but Bezu theorem. Again, watch our previous tutorials. We will um, prove this using both methods. Let's uh, prove first, and by first, by first method, by manual division. Let's divide x to the power 3, x cubed minus a cubed, and divide it by x minus a. And we will show that remainder of this division is equal to 0. That's why x cubed minus a cubed is divisible by x minus a. Let's perform a division. How to perform a division? Again, watch our previous tutorial in Algebra Playlist. Um, we write here x squared. Uh, x squared times x minus a is, first of all, let's write our polynomial as x cubed plus 0x squared plus 0x and minus a the power 3. And x squa squared times x minus a is equal to x to the power 3 minus a x squared. And if we perform a subtraction, we have a cancellation here. And result will be uh, 0 minus a x squared is equal to a x squared and we have to rewrite the rest next uh, we write here uh, plus a x and when we divide a x by x minus a we have uh, a x squared uh, minus a squared x and if we perform a subtraction we have a cancellation here and result of the subtraction will be a squared x minus a cubed and next we write here plus a squared uh, and when we multiply x squared by x minus a we have a squared x minus a cubed and after subtraction we have cancellation uh, we have total cancellation and result will be zero that's why we uh, we are showing here Let's write it here, that uh, this polynomial x cubed minus a cubed, cubed, x cubed, x to the power 3 minus a to the power 3, is divisible by x minus a, and uh, that's why it can be represented at, as x minus a times another polynomial, this polynomial result of division, a quotient, and this polynomial is equal to x squared plus ax plus a squared. Uh, so we uh, have a result. This formula is very important in algebra and uh, by using it was the first way and using the second way we also can prove that um, x cubed using theorem of Bezu uh, x cubed minus a cubed is divisible is divisible by x minus a uh, how theorem of Bezu is used we just 
take our P3 of X, this polynomial, and insert instead of X number A. And since uh, it will be equal to zero, that's why a remainder, remainder is a zero. And that's why um, that's why our polynomial is divisible by x minus a. And what will be the result of this division? We already shown. We already showing here. Uh, the result will be this polynomial. And that's why we have finally we have a result uh, because we had. Um, uh, result for n1, for n equal to 2, and for n, uh, which is equal to 3, we have a result that it will be x minus a times um, x squared plus ax plus a squared. We can continue our process for any n, and uh, the final result for any for any n for any positive integer n will be x to the power n minus a to the power n is divisible by x minus a and uh, the re quotient or the result of this division by x minus a is equal to it must be the polynomial of degree x uh, of degree n minus 1. So it will be x n minus 1 plus a x n minus 2 plus result or sorry, degree of a will decrease. It will be a squared and degree of x will decrease. It will be n minus 3 plus so on. And here we will have n minus 1. And here we will have x n minus n, which is 0, which is 0. And this will be equal to 1. So this is our um, important formula in algebra. And we have to remember it. Uh, how to prove this formula? We can use the same method for n3. Uh, why this polynomial is divisible by this polynomial? Again, we have to uh, use Bezu formula, Bezu theorem, because our polynomial xn minus an, uh, because Pn of a, if we insert instead of x, our a is equal to a to the power n minus a to the power n, which is 0. Because this is 0, remainder of division will be 0. That's why uh, our polynomial xn minus a n is divisible by x minus a. And result of this division can be found for any n using manual division. Um, that's all. That's why uh, Bezu uh, theorem is very important in algebra. Watch previous tutorials. Um, this formula is very important in algebra. In particular, using this formula, we uh, can calculate the sum of geometric progression. Uh, I will show how to use this formula for the sum of geometric, geometric progression in next tutorial. So watch our next tutorial. It was everything for this tutorial. Thank you very much. If you liked my video, like and subscribe us. Have a great day.